This is the Intermountain Railway HO scale Trinity Illuminator Coal Gondola. Now this is a six pack that MSRP is for $159.95 and there are also individuals that MSRP for $26.95. Now this is an Intermountain's value line. This means that they're an immense value MSRP and even the discounts available at brick and mortar hobby shops and online retailers to get a decent coal train for a good price. So we're going to take a look at some varying schemes of this coal gondola and then we're going to do a run by of several of these so stay tuned. I'm just going to unbox a single because I'm sure you can use your imagination to see how it is to unbox a six pack which is just six of these but there's no paperwork in the box you've got a hard plastic shell a soft plastic and then the gondola here which has a nice metallic finish and metal wheels those wonderful reliable Intermountain wheel sets we'll take a closer look at the model next this is Union Pacific Scheme, a beautiful scheme. My favorite, actually, personal favorite out of the schemes we have here. You can see the brake wheel and support bracing on the end. You can see the interior gondola support bracing on the inside. You can fit certain kits for coal, or you can obviously fill it up with the actual coal particles or black particles to make it look like a coal load anything you want in that aspect but the print is nice Union Pacific here on the side all that print seems to be pretty legible you got rivet detail you got the slopes of the gondola here like I mentioned earlier Intermountain wheel sets these are metal couplers magnetic trip pins then you've got the yellow end here that dictates the rotary end you can even see it there so really nice cars all around and we will do a couple tests with these all right we're going to run a quick coupler check oops didn't mean to actually couple that up there as my viewers taught me you actually just run it right before to check coupler height it looks about on but you have a better view than i do might be a little bit of a dip there check the other side this is just a sample. Obviously not going to check every coupler on every car, but when I do the run by, I'd obviously see if there's any problems. And there you go. There that does seem like it is angled downward slightly. Now sometimes it's simply tightening up a screw. Sometimes it's not that can fix that. All right, we're going to weigh this. You got 3.7 ounces. 105 grams, 0.105 kilograms, that's just under a quarter of a pound. Now NMRA says that should be four ounces per six inches and then a half an ounce for each additional inch. This is a seven and a quarter inch coupler to coupler car. So it should be about 4.5 ounces. We're at 3.8. Uh, it could be around four. It's not too far off and they may have done this to give people the ability to add coal loads in here and still be around NMRA weight. All right, last test we're gonna do before we take a look at a few different schemes is the NMRA gauge test for the wheel sets. Intermountain wheel sets, some of the best in the industry, if not the best in the industry. So I don't expect any problems and I don't have any, everything is in gauge. Just so you can see here, this is the Transisco leasing version, GEAX on the side, same details even pretty much the same paint scheme as the Union Pacific just different markings and you got that yellow rotary in there and you do have some variations in paint scheme as you can see here this goes completely down on the Union Pacific yellow this one stops and there's black on the bottom ladder rungs there Burlington Northern scheme is next up and as you can see beautiful green on the ends, Burlington Northern logo there, and a lot of the same great print quality. You can still read everything. 
nice overall detail for these areas here I don't know if these are supposed to be stair steps or actually represent separately applied grab irons but those are molded in details if anybody's curious those that know more about the prototype tell me but I believe those are not intended to be grab irons those are intended to be stair steps to get up into the tub or access the load or adjust things so those are molded on so there you have the review of the Intermountain HO Trinity Illuminator Coal Gondolas. There are more coal porters on the way. Most importantly, on these Trinity Illuminator Coal Gondolas, you've got Trinity Demonstrator Burlington Northern, a CIT Group Capital Finance, that's CITX, Canadian National, Detroit Edison, Transport Capital Rail Partners, Union Pacific, and Transico or Transisco leasing I should say those are all the schemes that are currently in stock that your dealers should be able to get a hold of so for the other ones I highly suggest you go to intermountain-railway.com to look at those products consider reserving them some of them are confirmed for production but some of them still need reservations like the Navajo mine coal porter so you have several different variations I'll be covering all those in the future videos this pretty much wraps up this video, so I'm going to leave you with a run-by of the coal porters I have here on hand, and we'll see you next time right here on my channel. Take care.